want to take this opportunity to appreciate Tree Adoption Uganda. We appreciate you very much for this effort that you've started. Uh, for the last 10 years you've been at it. You've ensured that trees are planted. You've ensured that trees are taken care of. And we appreciate the partnership that we have with you uh, for planting trees. We've done a good job in Guero. We hope that we can continue planting trees together. Let's ensure that we plant the tree somewhere. Centenary Bank is celebrating 40 years of transforming lives, improving lives, and changing communities. And we urge all these communities that we've been working with to plant a tree. If there are 2.5 million customers that Centenary Bank has, each of the 2.5 million customers planted a tree, it would make a huge difference in the years to come. This is a race towards climate. Climate change just that where we cannot leave anyone behind. We have to take everyone with us. And that's the message we have for you today as start. If you have any climate group you're working with, you can partner with us to fulfill this awareness that like, we have had today. I'm Charles Mate. I'm uh, the executive director for Trade Option Uganda. Trade Option Uganda is a youth social enterprise that uh, is powered by the vision of creating communities where people in nature flourish. Uh, at True Things, everyone knows us for Mawad and all the other steel products. But I must say that True Things started um, the fight against climate change uh, over 10 years ago. Uganda loses over 120,000 hectares of land uh, that is forested. This has contributed to the climate change that we see. So Tree Adoption Uganda hosts this run for climate to encourage the uh, private sector, civil society, the public to engage in tree growing. As Ministry of Water and Environment, we reached out to the private sector and other uh, non-state actors, uh, mainly religious, cultural, uh, education institutions, to, to join us on our global target where Uganda committed to restore 2.5 million hectares of degraded forest landscapes. In our factories, you will find um, seedlings. Actually, in Luboa, we have seedling nurseries. And every month, we produce about uh, 50,000 uh, seedlings. And we give this out for free. We started the Running Out of Trees campaign as a way of doing going business unusual. But uh, I'm very happy to have uh, joined uh, Mr. Robert Kapshenga as our key runner for today because the Running Out of Trees uh, campaign uh, originated from his office uh, when I approached him for, uh, we actually, the permanent secretary wrote to him requesting him to join us in our uh, run for forestry, run for trees. We are partnering with uh, Tree Adoption Uganda to do uh, environmental education in Chiriandongo refugee settlement, schools and in the host community. This year we are planting 1,000 trees uh, in partnership with Tau. And the goal this year is to restore 500 acres of land with 100,000 trees. And we hope you can join us in this mission.